Wow, just finished watching the Field of Dreams game between the White Sox and the Yankees. Massive W, MLB. Massive. That was so sick. What an amazing game. If you're seeing this video, that means that my Field of Dreams video has already been uploaded on the channel. If you haven't seen that, go click and watch it. Of course, I'm recording videos ahead because I'm going to Boston this weekend, which is why I'm kind of talking in the past. But today's video, I promise you, is a banger. You clicked it. You know what you're getting here. You saw the title. It's going to be Guess the Team. Now, I got this idea from a good friend of mine, Madden YouTuber Bengal. So if you want to go check him out, Madden NFL. Link is in the description down below. Essentially, what happens is you see a team on a field without pictures, without faces, without telling you what team it is. It's going to tell you their college. Now, baseball's a little tough. Not all the players went to college. So if they didn't go to college, it's going to have their flag, their nationality. So if you guys enjoy this and you want to see more Guess the Team videos like this, maybe an all-time team historic, drop a like on the video. That's the best way to show it. We get 4,000 likes on this. I'll do a Guess the Team part two. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and you enjoy the content. Click that sub button, join the team. Get in the comments down below. Let me know how many of these you got right and if you want to see more of this on the channel. And last but not least, make sure you drop me a follow on Twitter and Instagram at GiraffeNeckMark. Links in description. And I want to give a quick shout out to today's sponsor, EveryPlate. EveryPlate makes home cooking easy and affordable as a much cheaper alternative to ordering takeout, and it's just as delicious. One meal from EveryPlate is the same price as a cup of coffee. That's dirt cheap. At first, I was a little skeptical about a meal kit. I'm usually buying my own food because I think it's cheaper. But EveryPlate's price is so affordable, and the food is so delicious. I mean, take a look at what I got and take a look at what I made. So when I got my EveryPlate meal kit, I didn't know what to expect, but when I opened it up, I was very impressed. They gave me three great dishes to choose from, saucy cumin lime chicken tacos, balsamic Dijon chicken, and ponzu chili steak bowls. Since I was cooking for only myself that night, we were going with the chili steak bowl. The instructions were super easy to understand. They gave you the appropriate amount for the serving size that you need. Every plate couldn't have made it easier for me to make a delicious meal. And let me tell you, I mean, you see me, I'm cooking. Look at the flick of the wrist. And at the end of it all, I got an absolutely delicious meal. So try every plate for just $1.99 per meal by going to everyplate.com and using my code GiraffeNeckMark199. Again, you get every meal for just $1.99 by going to everyplate.com. Link is in the description and using my code GiraffeNeckMark199. That's up to $100 value. Thank you to EveryPlate for sponsoring today's video. Okay, so here's the first one. I'm gonna be looking to the right because it's on my computer screen here. In left field, we have an American that did not go to college. In center field, we have Long Beach State. In right field, Mississippi State. Third base, I believe that's a DR. Shortstop, that is Aruba. Second base, Puerto Rico. First base, University of Arizona, pitcher Florida Gulf Coast, and catcher is Puerto Rico with the DH going to no Nova Southeastern. Well, based on the Aruba shortstop and the Dominican third baseman, that leads me to believe it's the Boston Red Sox. Center field would be Jaron Duran, left field's gotta be Verdugo, Bogarts, Devers, Christian Arroyo at second base. Is that Christian Arroyo or is that Mauro Gonzalez? I'm not sure. I don't know if Christian Arroyo is like American or not. Probably should know that. Hunter Renfro on right, Dahlbeck at first, Christian Vasquez behind the plate, Chris Sale and JD Martinez. So I'm gonna go with Boston Red Sox. It's just too easy for me. I feel like that that's an easy one. I feel like I got that right off the rip. Let's go ahead and see. And boom. Yep. It's the Boston Red Sox. There we go. Cash money. I'm one for one. I'm feeling good. If we're one for one this early, I think we might be able to go 100% here. Let's go ahead and go for number two. Okay. Next up for this team, not a lot of colleges. So we got University of Virginia in left field. That doesn't really help. It's a good baseball school. Center field is America. Right field is America. Third base is Cal State Fullerton. Oh, Cal State Fullerton in third base. Shortstop is American. Second base is North Carolina State. That's NC State, and then first base is Baylor, catcher is Louisville, and then Vandy on the mound. Okay, Vandy pitchers, David Price, Walker Bueller, Sonny Gray. There's got to be a few more that I'm not remembering. Did Justin Turner play at Cal State Fullerton? Who plays left field? Left field would be, I mean, AJ Pollock, I'm pretty sure went to Notre Dame. I do know that Will Smith went to Louisville. Second base, NC State, Trey Turner, but he'd be shortstop. Oh my God, this is so confusing. This is so hard. What team is this? Baylor at first base, and then the outfield, I mean, Bellinger would be in center, and right field would be Mookie bets. I'm going to go with the, the Dodgers. I think it's the Dodgers here. I didn't know Max Muncy played at Baylor. I really had no clue, but this to me makes the most sense. Bueller, Will Smith. We got Justin Turner, I guess at Cal State. I don't know who was at Virginia, but we'll go with the Los Angeles Dodgers. Let's go ahead and see if I'm right. It is the Dodgers. Hell yeah. Let's go. Two for two. Okay. So in left field, it's actually Chris Taylor. That makes sense. He's University of Virginia. I didn't know where he went to school. I had to look it up, but yes, University of Virginia. Very good. Two for two. Here we go. Moving on to guess the team number three. We have got a lot of different. Wow. This is, this is all over the place here. So in left field, we have the Dominican. Center field, we have UConn. Right field, we have America. Third base, Notre Dame. Shortstop, America. Second base, what is that? Cal, Cal Berkeley? University of Cal? Okay. First base, we have Canadian. That throws me off. Who's a Canadian first baseman? Pitcher, South Korea. Catcher, Mexico. And then DH is Meridian Community College. So the center field for UConn leads me to believe that it's George Springer. But I know that there's like another UConn player, I think, at the majors. But George Springer is the one I think of. And then the pitcher on the mound being South Korean makes me think it's Hinjin Ryu, which would make sense because Kevin Biggio at third. Vladdy is technically 
Canadian, I believe. He's a Canadian Dominican Republic, like half and half. So to me, I believe this has to be the Toronto Blue Jays, which makes sense. Alejandro Kirk behind the plate. Second base, I guess Simeon went to Cal. Shortstop, Bichette. Yep, no college. Guriel or Teoscar in left field. Yeah, let's go with it. We're gonna go with the Blue Jays. Yes, it is the Blue Jays. All right, I'm off to a hot start. Three for three here. Let's keep it rolling. Let's move on to team number four. Let's go ahead and guess what team this is gonna be. We've got left field American. Center field is Cal State Dominguez Hill. Whoa, you have completely lost me now. Right field, Oregon State. Third base, Cal State Fullerton. Shortstop is USA. Second base is Long Beach. First base is Florida. Stetson University, Arkansas. Is this, is this a Brandon Nimmo? Or Brandon Nimmo, is this the New York Mets? The only thing I will say is I don't think Cal State Dominguez Hill, I don't think that's where Brandon Nimmo went to school. But I mean, Pete would be the Gators at first. Jeff McNeil, Long Beach second. JD Davis was a Cal State Fullerton guy. Michael Conforto, Oregon State. University of Arkansas, J yeah, this has got to be the New York Mets. It has to be. And I guess maybe Nimmo's in left and maybe that's Pilar in center. Let's go ahead and see who it is. And we have got the boom, New York Mets. So yeah, upon further review, it's Kevin Pilar in center field. So that makes sense. There we go. Okay, let's move on to team number five here. This one's a DH, so it's American League. We'll keep that in mind. Left field, American center field is UCA Bears. Who? Right field, Fresno State. Third base is Venezuelan. Shortstop is Venezuelan. Second base, LSU. First base, American. Catcher, American. Pitcher, UCLA. DH, UCA, or America. Is this the Yankees? UCLA on the mound would be Cole. Right field, Fresno State makes sense for Judge. Center, I guess, is Aaron Hicks. I, I don't think Brett Gart, maybe Brett Gardner. I don't know. Second base, LeMahieu. Venezuela is going to be Urshela and Torres. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the New York Yankees. That's kind of what it feels like here. Yankees, and it is the Yankees. Let's go. Nice. All right, we're, we're good. We're still 100%. Let's move on again. I believe this is what, team number six? Oh, there's a lot of countries on this one. A lot of Americas. America at left, center, right, third, and first. The pitcher's Japanese. The catcher's from LSU. Shortstop is Dominican. Second base is University of Michigan. Okay, so Japanese pitchers would be Yu Darvish. And the only other one that I think could be the number one would be Kikuchi. There's no Dimin Oh, this is the Padres. This is the Padres. Shortstop is going to be Tatis. Second base, Jay Cronenworth. Catcher, I think it's probably going to be Austin Nola. Yeah, that makes sense. We're going to go with San Diego Padres for this guess here. And it ends up being the, the San Diego Padres. There we go. I, you can't beat me on guess the team. We might have to do a historic one. That one would be a lot of fun. Make it really, really tough. But I like this. We're off to a hot start. Keep it going 100%. Ooh, okay. I see a Gamecock on there. Of course, that's my alma mater as a graduate of, a, of the University of South Carolina. Go Cox. Gamecock in center, America in left, Venezuela in right. Kent State. Who the heck? Who played at Kent State at third base? Shortstop is Dominican. Second base is University of Hawaii. First base is USA. Catcher is Venezuelan. And pitcher is St. Mary's College of California. Whoa, where are we with this one? Okay, so center field. The only Gamecock that I can think of that plays center field is Jackie Bradley Jr., which makes me believe that this is going to be the Milwaukee Brewers, which would mean Yelich in left. Obviously, Sal Garcia in right. That makes sense. Willie Adam is at shortstop. Who even plays third for them? Travis Shaw. Is that who they're going to say is at third? University of Wyatt second, Colton Wong. Yep. Okay. I'm going to go with the Milwaukee Brewers. Also, is that going to be Brandon Woodruff on the mound? Did he go to St. Mary's College of California? I'm going to check that after we see what team it is. And yes, it is the Milwaukee Brewers. Love it. Okay. So on the mound, it went with Corbin Burns. That's who it was. Brandon Woodruff, Mississippi State guy. That makes way more sense. Okay. Moving on to the next guest, the team here. I believe this is going to be number eight for us. Ooh, a lot of, a lot of Puerto Rico and Cuba on here. So we got US in left and right. Millersville in center. Oh, I wow, this is really hard. Who is this? Cuba at third and DH. Shortstop is Puerto Rico and so is catcher. Second base is Venezuela. First base is Gonzaga and pitcher is USA. Who in the world is this? Cuban DHs. Cuban DHs. Wow, this is super hard. Who is this? I'm gonna go team by team here. I'm gonna figure this one out. Is this the... No, this wouldn't be the White Sox, right? Because Tim Anderson's the shortstop. It's not them. I was thinking Jose Abreu. He's Cuban. Wow, this one's stumping me really good. Is this out west? Is this like the Astro? No, Guriel. Guriel went to, uh, he's Cuban. So unless they're putting someone else at first? No, because then Alex Bregman's at third base. He went to LSU. Oh my God. I don't know who this is. I'm stumped. I'm genuinely stumped at what team this is. I'm blanking out. This is not good. Hello? No, the A's. Matt Olson was drafted out of high school. I don't, I don't have a clue. I literally don't have a clue who this is. Is this the, is that the Orioles? The Rays? No, because Brandon Lau would be playing second and Wander's the shortstop and third base would be like Joey Wendell. I don't think it's the Rays, even though that feels very Rays-like. I'm really just stumped. I have no clue. It's not the Red Sox. It's not the Rays. It's not the Blue Jays. Not the Yankees. It's not the Orioles. It's not the White Sox. Is this, it's not the Tigers. Is this the twin? Is this the Twins? No. Miguel Sano. Royals. If this is the Royals, you got me. You got me. I have no clue. Could it be the Royals? No. Eh, no, because Whit Merrifield's a Gamecock. Oh my God. What team is this? Indians? Is this the Indians? Could this be the Indians? I don't think it is the Indians, but I can't think of anybody else. So I'm going with the Indians and that just feels, that feels bad. That feels like a bad guess. This is the Houston Astros. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay. I get it. Oh yeah. Cause Brett.
Bregman's hurt, so that's why I went there. First base, Guriel's hurt. Jordan's the DH. Oh, man. Okay, okay. I get it. I see it. I see it. That one's on me. I, uh, I messed that one up. Okay, Astros. It was the Astros. That one was the hardest one by far. That's the hardest. Okay, number nine, we've got Louisville in left, then Cuba in center in right. Shortstop is gonna be Vandy. Is that Cuba? Is that Cuba? Now I'm starting to question my flag knowledge. Second, oh, okay. I actually know who it is. Vandy at short and second base is gonna be, I believe that's Aruba, or not Aruba. Is that Panama? Where's Ozzy Albies from? Curacao. Curacao. He's Curacao. So I believe this is the Braves. Pretty sure this is the Braves. I'm gonna go with it. Atlanta Braves, which would make sense because they're using current roster, so Acuna wouldn't be in there. And that makes it tougher. Yep, Atlanta Braves. There we go. Okay. I, I feel better about that one. I'm starting to get these right a little bit. They're getting tricky. These ones got a lot harder when they started throwing in some different people. It's not necessarily always the guaranteed starting nine that you think of. It could be the one that they're throwing out there right now. Starting to learn. We're starting to learn. We're on to number 10 here. Only got one wrong. I actually know who this is right off the rift, but I'm going to go through it. So left field, USA. Center field, Campbell. Center, center field, Campbell Camels, which gives it away. Uh, right field is going to be Jackson Universe. Jacksonville University, my bad. Dominican at third. Mexico at short. UCLA second. First base, America. West Virginia center field. Patrick's Dominican. DH Notre Dame. The Notre Dame and the Campbell makes it obvious for me. It's going to be the Baltimore Orioles. Cedric Mullins and Trey Mancini. That's all I need to know. And that's all you need to know from this team too. And yes, it's the Baltimore Orioles. Let's go. All right, we've got two more here coming towards the end. In left field, it's University of California, Berkeley. Okay. Center field is Cuban. Right field is Louisville. Third base is Cuban. I think, I think I know where this is now. I think that this is going to be, this gotta be the White Sox, right? Oh, wait, no, Dominican DH. Oh, wait, Eloy, Eloy, Eloy. Yes, no, this is it. This gotta be the White Sox because then center field would be Luis Robert. Third base, Moncada. First base, Abreu. DH is Eloy. Tim Anderson is short. Who's playing second base? Cesar Hernandez. Okay, I like it. White Sox, Chicago White Sox. Show me the White Sox. And it is the White Sox. Let's go. Okay, on to the last one here. Looking to get 11 out of 12. Left field is Ole Miss. Center field is Vandy. Right field is Dominican Republic. Third base, USA. Shortstop, University of Arizona. Second base, South Korea. First base, Florida State. There's a there's a South Korean second baseman. Who is this? South Korean second baseman. All I can think of is Ha Sung Kim, and we already did the Padres. Pitcher is from the University of Akron? What? Catcher, North Carolina. What team is this? I've never been so confused in my life. Flor Whoa. South Korean second baseman. And it's a National League team. Is this the Pirates? Could this be the Pirates? I think it is the Pirates. I think it is. Is this going to be um Hoy Park? The guy who they just got from the Yankees? Is that who's playing second base for the Pirates now? Because they got rid of Adam Frazier. And center field would be Brian Reynolds. I, I think we got it. I think we got it. I think that this is the Pirates. And if this is right, what a perfect ender. Because there's no way I should know this. It is the Pittsburgh Pirates. Wow. Okay. I can't believe I got that right. That was probably the hardest one. That one and the Astros, which are the two I almost messed up. I did mess up the Astros, didn't mess up the Pirates, but this was a lot of fun. Do you think I should do this again? If you do, drop a like on the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the content. Like I said, 4,000 likes on this video. We'll do a part two to guess the team. Get in the comment section down below. Let me know how many you got right. Drop me a follow on Twitter and Instagram at GiraffeNickMark. Links in the description. And that's where I'm wrapping up today's video. You guys know the drill from here on out. YouTube recommends you watch this video. This is my most recent upload. Click through those if you have not yet seen them. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all next time for another video. Bye.